In this video, we'll be looking at categorical versus quantitative variables. Previously, we learned that variables tell us what we want to know about who we're studying. There are two major types of variables in statistics, categorical and quantitative. Categorical variables address how cases fall into groups, while quantitative variables give a measurement and comes with units. Let's take a look at our old friend Jason the Runner and his friend Ken. If I ask what is clearly different about these two men, it is likely that you'll notice that one is tall and the other short. These are two groups in which our cases fall, making the data categorical. We can also give their heights, for example, 6 foot 1 and 5 foot 2. Since these are measurements with units, the data here is quantitative. Let's look at another example. Here are two circles. If I asked for the distinguishing quality of these circles, you'd probably tell me their colors, blue and red. Colors are example of categorical data since it's a way to group our cases. How about the information told to us by a clock? A clock can tell us how much time has passed. For example, 10 minutes, a measurement with units, hence quantitative. Or it can tell you that you've been waiting for a long time or a short time, categories. Let's look at baby Mikey and his grandpa Errol. Mikey is young and Errol is old. These are both categorical data. But if instead I said that Mikey is one year old and Errol is 82 years old, since these are measurements with units, the data is quantitative. Let's replace Errol with Mikey's big brother Shane and examine the question, can a variable be both categorical and quantitative? Mikey is one year old and Shane is two years old. We've already said that this is quantitative data since age is a measurement of time. However, suppose their ages are being provided as a means to group these students in a daycare center. Suddenly, their ages now represent categories. Based on the context, numbers can represent categorical data too. Let's summarize what we learned in this video. Categorical variables address how variables fall into groups. Quantitative variables give a measurement and comes with units. And remember, numbers can represent categories too, depending on the context.